welcome to Montana's Peer Network How-To Video Series. Thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Jim Haney, the Executive Director. We've been the leader in the recovery movement in Montana since 2011. So in this video, we're going to be going over how to apply to the Board of Directors. Now, before we get started, let me say a couple things about joining the Board of Directors of a nonprofit. This is not something to be taken lightly. A position on the board of MPN requires a large commitment from you. For example, we require three to five hours per month of your time, financial contributions, and as a board member, you would be legally responsible for a nonprofit corporation. Now, all of this is included in the commitment form, which is part of the application when you apply, which we will go over. But I just want to emphasize this, that this is a corporation and you would be applying to the board of directors. And so be sure that you would meet these requirements before starting the application. Okay, so we're going to take a look at how to apply to the board of directors. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to put in uh, the web link uh, MT peernetwork.org right here up at the top and this is our web page okay I have this nice slider window that rotates around and you're going to come over here to the right hand side and you're going to go to get involved and if you see if I just mouse on this uh, you can see the third choice down is apply to be a board member so you're going to click on that and this is the screen that's going to come up and you can see there is some uh, information here kind of uh, reiterating some of the things that I already shared and some of the things that you're going to see on the application. So if you read through that and, uh, you know, you answer yes to those things um, and you would like to proceed, you're going to come down here to please complete an application. And you're going to click on the application right here. And that's going to take you to an online application. So um, this is just going to walk you through, um, talks a little bit about the organization and who we are, um, <clears throat> our mission statement, uh, talks about this being voluntary and uh, the term length and the number of board members. And uh, if you click on that, there's some basic questions in the beginning. Are you at least 18? Are you a current member of MPN? Right. So yes. 70% uh, of the board members must identify as being in recovery from mental health, substance use, or addiction diagnosis. Does this describe you? Yes. You know, do you agree to abide by the corporate bylaws and policies and procedures? Yes. Are you willing to volunteer time and resources to fulfill the requirements of the board of directors? Yes. Do you have access to high-speed internet? So uh, this might seem like an obvious yes, but you might be filling this application out, um, you know, at an office or, um, you know, a friend's house. Um, so this is an important one to consider because um, you need high-speed internet to do video conferencing, and so you need to have access. So consider that question. Um, and that's, are you able to attend video conference or in-person board meetings or committee meetings throughout the year? Yes. Are you willing to travel to in-person meetings? Um, you know, if you have a disability or you have trouble traveling, this is where you're going to want to check other, and then you're going to want to put that in the box so we can help uh, make arrangements for you. And then it's going to go into some basic uh, kind of demographic information, you know, contact information, that kind of thing. There's 30 questions total, and I'm not going to walk through the entire application with you. Um, it's pretty straightforward. Um, you know, we just ask that you, um, when you're filling it out, be honest and upfront, and um, you know, just give us the reasons why you want to join the board and, and be accurate. And then at the end, it explains the rest of the process, how the application. Uh, it comes here to the office and then it gets reviewed and sent over to the board of directors and they're going to review it. And then the board president's responsibility is to 
contact um, candidates. And, uh, you know, if you're denied, we send out a nice letter to you. Um, or we have this process where you complete some assignments for the board, you attend a couple of board meetings, and um, you also, um, many candidates are invited to participate in committee hearings. Uh, committee me meetings, sorry, not hearings, committee meetings. And so um, you would get involved maybe with some of the committees over a period of time um, before the board would um, even vote on accepting you. So uh, with Montana's Peer Network, the process uh, is a little bit of a lengthy one. I tell people, be patient. And, you know, it's probably going to take, you know, a good two, three, four months to go through the process because we really want the best candidates and we want uh, you to be sure that you have the time uh, to dedicate to the organization. Thanks so much for watching this video. We really hope you enjoyed it. If you need more information, please visit our website, mtpeernetwork.org. And don't forget to subscribe 